LCX, get ready for LCX Special Telegram AMA, October 10th, 6 p.m. This is great because you can ask Monty literally any questions about LCX. And I've been saying, you know, I haven't covered LCX in a long time. It's been a while, not much to really update. But you guys asked me for an update on this crypto. It's at a great price, which we'll get to in a minute. But I wanted to highlight the fact that I've said in the past and I still reiterate today that Monty's a very proactive CEO and he really answers and engages with the community a lot. Now, you may think of that as, oh, it's not a big deal, but it really is. OK, investors want to know what's going on with their crypto. They also want a CEO who's not just a ghost and just never shows up, never talks about the project, really never does AMAs never what they want to do. Like Monty is literally engaging every single day. And, you know, an AMA like this is a very good opportunity for you guys. If you want to ask some questions for Monty, I'm going to try to uh, get in on this as well. I don't have a telegram, but I'll see what I can do. But if you scroll down here, Look, five hours ago, it says exciting news. Just added 10 new timings to elevate your collections and make it shine brighter. Monty speaks about use case. A good reason why I want to cover LCX today is because it's priced at four cents. The one year low was just shy of three cents. It's a 30 million market cap. So it's a micro cap crypto. It has 80% in circulating supply, a 950 million coin cap which is significant because getting to a dollar is less than a 1 billion market cap. Most of your crap meme coins make it to a billion plus market cap. Pepe itself went to a multi-billion market cap in a bear market. LCX has scaled before. If you click the one year chart, you'll not only see the three cent one year low, but you'll see the 16 cents it reached back in January this year, okay? Micro caps can rip it. They're very volatile because it's low liquidity with them, right? And when you go to LCX's tokenomics and you go to the top 100, it's very spread out. You don't see the top 10, top 20, or top 100 holding 90% of supply. LCX is very decentralized when it comes to the marketplace, especially for a micro cap crypto. Usually micro caps have a very highly centralized marketplace because they're often less established and the team is holding a very large allocation. LCX is also an exchange, a legit business. How many cryptos out there can say they're an actual business? Now I know exchanges are risky, especially if you've seen you know, Celsius go down, FTX, BlockFi, to name a few. Okay, they are definitely risky, but LCX is compliant and following the regulatory guidelines. Okay, it's also not in the US. So in terms of being pursued by the SEC, very slim to none. It really can't, they can't do anything. The SEC really can't do anything. They once called the token a security once, you know, a while back with nine other cryptos when they were attacking Coinbase, but they never said anything again. So it was pretty much a nothing burger. LCX, you know, it, they're trying to be a blockchain bank. They're going to be the institutional, go-to institutional exchange, which is huge because what do institutions and businesses have? A lot of money, right? And if LCX someday does become a blockchain bank or comes out their own blockchain and maybe uses their token as gas you're going to see it a deflationary lcx now, i don't want to cause some fomo here but lcx is going to net some insane multipliers this bull cycle getting to a dollar to me is pretty conservative like i said a dollar is a 950 million market cap okay the previous all-time high was 68 cents I wanted to make this video because I did get some questions about it, not just from my Discord members, but I've seen some comments where some people are fearful, you know, with uh, LCX because it's down to four cents. Um, the altcoins right now in general, especially for the top 100, are bleeding significantly to Bitcoin, okay? It's nothing new. Also, there was some FUD that the exchange was low on liquidity and that people were just selling it out of fear. You know, you're gonna, you're gonna get that. Because it's a micro cap crypto, it doesn't take much fear or panic to drop the price. But I look at that as a big discount. Now, I haven't bought much LCX recently, but my bag is packed and it's ready. And I actually might look to get some more. I'm at this point now with my crypto portfolio where I wanna buy everything. And I essentially go down my watch list and whatever's the biggest discount, and I don't have enough of it in my eyes, then I just look through DCA and add some more. By the way, if you wanna reach out to me, talk to me, your crypto on buying sell and trading run your portfolio by me ask me questions or be a part of a support group where we talk about many different topics like this different cryptos the news the updates or be in a position to take profits before the masses do 
then feel free to join my Patreon and Discord. I'll leave a link in the pinned comments down below. It would be awesome to see you there. But LCX right now, if it holds this 4 cent mark, or even better, it gets lower, close to that one year low of 3 cents, I'm definitely gonna look to gobble up some more. Again, low inflation, a decentralized marketplace, a legit business, a scarce supply, a good leader who cares about the community, is doing an AMA, good partnerships, a regulatory compliant exchange. Okay, they list this, their registrations on their website. Centralized exchanges are not going anywhere. I know the majority of crypto enthusiasts want to see uh, people come into the market and use DEXs like Uniswap, PancakeSwap. Listen, the majority of people are lazy. Not only that, but nobody wants to really use a DEX. The only ones who are using a DEX are like people that want to take those extra steps to do it. Okay, most people want a beginner friendly, easy exchange. And I'm not saying the LCX has the best interface because let's be honest here, it doesn't. But when it comes to institutions and businesses who have a lot of money, what can they do? They can hire somebody to figure it out. So in my eyes, LCX is in a great position. I really don't see too many exchanges that are chasing this market, this audience. And I think their business model is very good, especially if they do accomplish their mission to tokenize trillions of dollars of assets. There's a lot going on right now that we don't see. And I really hope Monty releases some really good news uh, in this AMA, so I'll definitely be keeping my eyes on that. Don't be surprised if the volatility for LCX in the days leading up to this AMA is very volatile. But without rambling too long, I definitely think LCX should be on your watch list if it isn't already. But now I want to hear from you. How do you feel about LCX at 4 cents and where do you see its price by the end of this bull cycle? Drop your comments down below and let me know. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. It really helps so much. That being said, I hope you have a great day and I'll see you in the next video.